What is the Monte Carlo method? The Monte Carlo method is a way of finding the value of something by simulating it out numerous times and getting the average value of the results. Let's take the example of rolling two dice. We want to know what the chances are of rolling a total of seven. The Monte Carlo approach would be to roll two dice thousands of times and look at how often a total of seven came up. In this example, we could figure that out with basic math. But for other more complicated examples, a straightforward method isn't always available. In financial planning, people will often assume long-term returns on stocks of about 6 to 10% a year, as this is the historical average. In reality, the stock market rarely returns 6%. Sometimes it returns higher, sometimes it returns lower, though on average it returns 6% a year. This variability is important. If your first years of retirement start with losses, that could severely hurt your chance of having enough. If you're trying to figure out whether you're on the right track financially, you need to take this variability of returns into account. To do this using the Monte Carlo method, we first look at your portfolio of investments to determine what kind of dice we're rolling. Whether they be stocks, with a wide variety of returns but a higher average, bonds with a consistent range of returns but lower average, or some mix in between, it's important to know the statistical attributes of your portfolio. Along with this information on your portfolio, we also need to take into account your cash flows, everything from regular inflows and outflows, like salary and expenses, or even one-off items like an inheritance or purchases like a new car. We put all this together to simulate your net worth over a lifetime, modeling out your portfolio return according to its statistical attributes. We then repeat this simulation thousands of times to get a better picture of all the possible futures your current financial path would lead you. We then take the proportion of simulations where you didn't run out of money and give this back to you as your success score, your chance of not running out of money given your investments, lifestyle, and financial goals. Your average estimated net worth and success score over time can also be shown. We also tell you if you were to get unlucky with those investments, what the downside estimates for your net worth would be. Hopefully you're on a good enough path that even if you were to get unlucky, you could still afford your lifestyle and achieve all your financial goals. If not, you can play with the simulation inputs to see what it would take to achieve that level of security. That's briefly how a Monte Carlo simulation works and how it's used on PeerSense to help check how you're doing with your personal finances. Try it out for yourself at PeerSense.com.